Win like a monster with the new Sweatproof Monster Eye Sport headphones. On ear, in ear, wired, Bluetooth. Find your style. Just go to plughitslive.com slash monster. Hey guys, Scott here with Plug Hits Live, part of the Tech Podcast Network. We're here at Showstoppers 2017 at CES, and uh, I'm here at the Gormia booth with Daniel, and we've got some kitchen stuff, which is something we don't usually see at a tech show. So uh, what have we got going on here? You're right, you know, normally we don't always see kitchen appliances at CES, but we've got some very innovative ideas at Gourmet that really might take it to another place where you're interested in a little bit of tech. Um, number one, have you heard of air fryers? Absolutely. Okay, so air fryers are a pretty big thing. They're the way that you can really cook food like French fries, but without the fat. Uh, Gourmet kind of raised the bar a little bit and they go a bit more into the next level. This air fryer is exactly that. Um, you have a rotisserie uh, chicken option that you can have here and also a basket that rotates if you're putting french fries in but a very intense heat up here which is halogen so you can actually cook like meats on the bone and chicken on the bone which you couldn't do in the traditional air fryer. Wow that's that's fantastic. Now how big is the inside like how how much can we get in here you've got like an eight quart capacity here so you can really do a lot but the clever thing is a lot of people get a bit intimidated by how to function some of these displays you can get it from your app so everyone knows how to use their apps so easily so user friendly is what this is all about so again taking it to the next level and that's why this is here at CES so basically you turn the front into just a a quick check of what's going on but you control it from the phone or tablet or something absolutely it's a little easier way to do that uh, but also the convenience and it's the health aspect so you can make things like my favorites a kale chip here uh, so really kind of guilt-free food that you can get in an air fryer so if you don't have an air fryer I think every kitchen in America should have one. Okay, and are these available now? Yeah, Amazon is a really big player for Gourmet. Some of the big retailers, you'll see Bed Bath Beyond, Kohl's, um, and also Best Buy. So if you check out those, but Amazon has got pretty much all of the lineup. Okay, fantastic. And do you know what the the going price on these guys is? About $249. It does vary, depends on sales and which retailers are doing special offers. Sure, fantastic. But that's not all we've got. It looks like we got a coffee pot over here. We've got a coffee pot and um, it looks like a traditional regular coffee pot that's kind of nice aesthetics because you've got the stainless steel so you'd want to keep it out but the beauty of that is Alexa. So we're becoming like not smartphones, smart houses. So I'm sure you've seen this all over CES. How are we talking to our house? So now you get in the shower, you wake up and you say Mia, I would like my coffee and your coffee's going to be done by the time you walk down the stairs. I, I love the Mia. That's fantastic. Clever. That wasn't my idea. I wish it was. <laughs> you know, we can give you credit for it if you like, though. Okay, yeah, it was my idea. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, so what's the going rate on these guys? Um, anything from one forty nine, one ninety nine is about the average point. Gourmet, or actually, we haven't got it here, but they've got a brilliant new coffee machine that is the first of its kind to take all of the pods, which means you can use from Kerrig to Nespresso, all of them. So, how clever is that? That's really good. It's it's like a uh, an unlocked phone for coffee. It's exactly what it is. <laughs> and how many times have we returned or taken those pods and they don't fit and like, oh, I can't be bothered to return them. Right. So they're really clever. They're very innovative. So that's why I wanted to get behind them. I've seen uh, my background's home shopping, so I've seen a lot of appliances, and that's what really attracted me to do the online videos and get behind Gourmet. Is they're a bit more above the rest. And I I like that. You know, sometimes kitchen appliances, especially like an air fryer, is kind of generic and kitchen looking, looking -y, you know, but this is a good looking device. Well, and it's for your Star Wars fans, isn't it, really? Because it <laughs> looks like it's something that's just crawled off of the new Star Wars movie. It, it does kind of have a BB-8 look to it. Yep. <laughs> Fantastic. But that's not all we've got. Let's see what else we have. Okay. All right. So we talked about a coffee pot. Now it looks like we have another hot water thing, maybe tea? I'm British, of course it's gotta be tea. It's gotta be tea, you gotta have a good cup of tea in the morning. Uh, but this, I mean, how beautifully designed, it really is so impressive. I, I love that design. We talked about the look of the other two, but yeah, 
but so far this is the winner for me. Yeah, it looks like you're in a five-star hotel, very modern, very sleek, and it's like, what do I do with it? Um, what it does is it does brew the perfect cup of tea. It's so well done, and you know, again, raising the bar, Gourmet, that's what they do. But the nice thing about this, again, is it's got the Alexa app, so you could actually go on there and say, I want that cup of tea in the morning, whatever time, and then you're ready to go. So a, a very innovative way, but the one thing is, some people don't like a lot of their appliances left out on the countertop. That I would love to leave on the countertop. Right? It's It doesn't even look like an appliance almost. It's so cool looking. I think so. I mean, I love the aesthetics. I think they've done a beautiful job on that. Yeah, for sure. And then next to it, we have boiling water or something. What have we got going on here? With a stick blender. No. So it looks like a stick blender. So I come from an industry of designing menus. And I've been a lot in the hotel industry. I actually design the menus for a big airline at the moment. And we're used to having real industrial sous vides. Sous vides goes back to ancient times of cooking, which is real slow cooking. And normally it's only safe for restaurants. Gourmet came up with something quite brilliant. It is a size of a stick blender. You can make anything, any pot, stock pot into a sous vide which means you clip this onto a stock pot, you set it at a temperature, and you have vacuum sealed bags that you put in like beef and fish, and it is the most slow cooked succulent way of cooking. So you kind of leave it and you let it go, and you can cook beef for like four to five hours, set it on your app and have a look at it, but you will get, I mean, my favorite way of actually using a sous vide is you can take the cheapest pieces of meat and pork that normally if you do it in a fry pan or oven become really fatty and not, not tender, just succulent. So, I mean, it, there's a time and a place for sous vide. I wouldn't do everything in a sous vide cooker, but when you do cook certain meats in that, perfection. What is your absolute favorite thing to do in a sous vide cooker? I would say a rack of lamb or something on the bone that really gets succulent on the bone, beautiful beef, beautiful meats, uh, really in a, a wonderful way with a little bit of flavor, like a bit of rosemary and something that intensely goes all the way through it. So for a chef, it's just a dream to cook. That's great. So we've got two, more, two devices here. What are their price points? We'll start with the, the teapot. About $200 for the tea. Uh, but again, you're paying for a lot of the looks and the way that the quality is there. The plus, plus Alexa. Plus Alexa. Uh, the sous vide is a brilliant price. It's a hundred. She, she heard me. Now, she didn't hear me because she doesn't understand the British accent. I've tried. It's like my uh, Siri. I just can't get it to work. Siri set the alarm. What? Um, so sous vide though is $149, really well priced. I think also no clutter, stays in a kitchen cupboard, you don't have to have a big appliance. And it's for, I think that foodie that likes watching Food Network, this kind of, I want to go to the next level of cooking. So for CES to have an appliance like this, I think it's kind of cool. And on, and on this guy, how big of a, of a pot or a container. Size. I mean, as big as if you've even got a 16 quart stock pot, it will heat it to that temperature. May take a little longer to get there, but when you're slow cooking, time isn't of the essence. Fair enough. Well, I really appreciate you uh, taking the time to talk to us today. Thank you. It's lovely talking to you. For continuing CES and Showstoppers 2017 coverage, stay tuned to PluggitsLive.com.